In the previous video, we saw the manual calculation of uh, these two Excel formulas, duration and amp duration, uh, specifically for bonds. So, in this video, we're gonna talk a little bit about duration and amp duration, a little bit more about these two formulas. What are they? What do they signify? Okay, to start with, let's start with uh, the amp duration. First, we talk about amp duration, then we'll talk a little bit about duration and uh, why duration is calculated in years I mean what does it mean 1.777 years okay so for duration for M duration uh, let's take a same example okay. I have taken the same example over here I'll just change the formula a little bit okay now we are ready so uh, suppose this is the uh, so this is the example we did last time and this is the same example we have, we have copied over here now what happen if the yield changes by uh, a certain percentage so it is denoted by m duration so let's see what happens if we change the yield by uh, to 4.01% okay so its value has changed let's see how much it has changed if we have increased the yield the price shall decrease right so the price has decreased by 2 to 7 now let's calculate the fall in price using M duration it also gives you 2 to 7 2 to 7 3 2 to 7 3 which is approximately the same number so this what we have derived here is known as DV01 now let's talk about uh, duration uh, in this formula what does 1.77 years means okay so let's take the same example in the new sheet okay. Paste. let me zoom a little bit okay now uh, 1.77 years it, it means uh, uh, let's let's do it over here <coughs> Years that is 0.51 1 1.5 I'm leaving this column blank for a moment and 2 so these are the years we will have certain cash flows uh, and the cash flows would be 10 10 10 and we are 110 and the present value of these cash flows we have already calculated over here going to be nine nine point six <coughs> this and at the end of year two the present value would be this okay so uh, the the formula duration signifies how much time will it take to cover the uh, the value of a bond five hundred dollar now to understand uh, since duration shows how much time is gonna take to cover this hundred dollar in in year five we will cover nine point eight then nine point six then nine point four till now we have covered twenty eight point eight three dollars and in year two we will cover one thirty dollars so somewhere between one point five and two years we will cover the remaining uh, around seventy dollars to cover hundred dollars okay so now somewhere between 1.5 to 2 years we gonna have around 71.16 dollars this is not going to be a cash flow but uh, we can call it a crude amount this 
amount is going to take place on 1.77 years so ideally uh, this will make hundred dollars which is denoted by the duration